Welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing another BoxyCharm video. We're gonna completely skip over July because... <sighs> so let's see what we got in this August box of goodies from BoxyCharm. First thing I got in this box were a set of three ESW Beauty Raw Juice Cleanse Masks. So there are three that came in this uh, month's box, which they look very intriguing. One is Watermelon Rose Water Grapefruit, the Pink Dream Moisturizing Raw Juice Mask. It says Transfer, transform a dry and rough complexion with this sheet mask featuring watermelon, rose water, and grapefruit extract. These ingredients work together to create a formula that hydrates and nourishes your skin. This essence is packed with vitamin E and vitamin C, which provide intense moisturization and a healthy glow. For a known fact, vitamin C is used for brightening as well, in case you guys didn't know that. And actually, vitamin E is actually very firming as well. I've actually used to, <laughs> it's gonna sound funny, I used to pop vitamin E capsules open when I was like in high school, and I used to rub them on my under eye. I know it sounds so weird, but it actually is very good for firming. Um, so this is actually very intriguing to me. The other two that I got were ESW, the Pineapple Kiwi Pear Ginger, Pineapple Bliss Revitalizing Raw Juice Mask. This says that it rejuvenates dull, tired skin and brightens your complexion with this pineapple infused sheet mask. Kiwi, ginger, and pear extracts work together to provide nutrition to your skin and leave it smooth and supple. Um, I don't really know too much about pineapple. I have been seeing it a lot in a lot of face products, I guess you could say, like the more uh, cleansing products and the more spa oriented products, not makeup. I don't know what I'm trying to say, but point being is I have seen it in a lot of face products and I don't, I have to, I have to do some research on pineapple because I really don't know too much about it, but I do like to eat it. Um, the third one is an HTO, HTO, H2O activated charcoal lemon juice mask. This is a deep detox mask, pore control, and again, it's a raw juice mask. So. This pore control targeted sheet mask contains activated charcoal, lemon juice, and H2O, which help detox your skin. Charcoal, the star ingredient of the skin treatment, purifies, decongests, and draws out dirt and impurities from your pores. So this one is um, not as needed for me, I would say, but definitely um, something I'm interested in. So I'm definitely wanting to try one of these. So I will probably try one and either maybe I'll film it for you guys or maybe I'll just let you know what I think in the box below. But I will have to try one tonight for you just so I can give you the lowdown on these. But they're definitely intriguing. So I'm, I'm enticed. Um, so three of these retails for $18 or one. Oh wait, I don't know now. It says set of three and then it says it retails for $18. So I don't know if the set retails for $18 or one retails for $18. I will have to check into that for you. But um, the three of these say $18. The second thing I got in my box was the QMS Medi Cosmetics Active Glow Tinted Day Cream. So it says a lightweight sheer color adaptive cream with vitamins helps to blur imperfections to real visibly glowing even skin. The combination of a skin perfecting light and hydrating formula makes this an ideal day cream. This is worth $105. Holy crap, holy. So I'm gonna use my Sigma Round Kabuki Brush F82 because why not dirty a brand new brush? Sir, hello. There you are. This looks kind of dark. What color is this? Is there a color on this? No? Ma'am? There's no shade on this? Okay. They're not lying when they say it is a light coverage because you can see all my blemishes still coming through. Don't like that. I mean, again, I'm not a light coverage person. I guess this was like a summer idea. And again, this little spout for being $105, it should not be that difficult to pump stuff. Oh my God, that just went on my shirt. I will give her props that came right out of my shirt, so that's nice. <laughs> I don't want to like anything that has no coverage. Like I am a full coverage girl, as I said. I'm not seeing like a, a notice to my skin. I do see a little bit of like that glow 
that they were saying it does feel a little hydrating i won't i won't say that like it does feel hydrating and it does definitely have a glow to it very sheer it doesn't even give like a slight coverage and i feel like it's not evening out my skin tone like if i was gonna buy a product like this i would have it says it helps blur imperfections but it's not really doing that for me the next thing we got was this butter london teddy boy eyeshadow palette this retails for 28 dollars so i'm gonna open it up for you i'm gonna open it up for you and it says teddy boy and it opens up on the sides like that. you know I, you would think after how many eyeshadow palettes have i owned i never get used to that film falling out ever on any of my products so it opens up like this and it has a mirror on this side and it says looking good darling on the other side which is so cute i love that um and all of these shadows are named after men which i think is so funny the first shade right here is freddie simon mick francis billy nigel archie Graham and Rupert and these all sound like rich men names um so I'm gonna swatch these for you and then so these are the shades uh, starting from the bottom is Freddy so Freddy Simon Mick Francis Billy Nigel Archie Graham and Rupert so ooh, sorry guys you guys can't in my belly in this shot um, so those are the shades. They were a little sketchy pigmented, pigmenting, that's not even the word. Um, they were a little sketchy when swatching them on my arm. So I don't know how I feel about that, but we're going to try them out on our face because everything's always different on your face. My eyelids, I'm going to use the NYX Gotcha Covered Concealer. And this is in the shade Ivory. So I'm just going to put that on my finger. My finger. Remember Charlie? Charlie bit my finger. So I'm going to grab my Sigma E40, my 40, and I'm just going to take the shade Nigel, which is this whitish shade over here. Oof. All right, so I'm just going to blend this into my crease. So that did nothing. Thanks, Nigel, though. You set our face. So let's see. I'm going to take the shade Simon. You know what? We're going to give Simon a chance here. Maybe he'll, uh, he'll do something more for us than Nigel did. Simon, come on. Give me something. Hey, I like I like you, Simon. I like you, Simon. I'm gonna take Graham down here. We're gonna go we're gonna go out with Graham here. Give him a chance. Um, it's like this dark brown. And I'm gonna dot it on the Ooh, it's a little chalky. I'm gonna dot it on the outside and then blend it in a little bit. So we're gonna kind of darken up what we have going on there. I think I'm loving this actually so far. First of all, they're very easy to blend. They are super pigmented on the eye. A little bit though, Graham's a little patchy, like oh, just a tad bit patchy. I don't know if you guys can really see that on camera there, but he is a little patchy, but that's okay. You know, if he's a good guy and he, he, you know, he's buildable. That's all that matters. I'm going to take Billy right here. Billy right in the middle. With this. Oh, they might come off better with my finger. My finger. All right, let's just take our Luxie Precision Shader Brush 239. And we're just going to see what happens when I just kind of pack it on there. Hey guys, so I'm back. I put foundation on, kind of touched up my face and whatever, and did my brows. Next thing that I got in my boxy trying box for the month of August was the Aesthetica Sunset Bronzer. It's the perfect shade of amber to bestow a beachy glow without even stepping foot on the sand. The rich coppery tone lends just the right amount of color for a neutral looking tan. Okay, so it looks like this. There is a little mirror. It is this light shade. Swatch it out for you. Looks like it's buildable. So let's dip our angled brush. Oops, a lot of that again. And just go over where we contoured. It is very light. 
it's very soft and like buttery. It's buildable. I like that you can start off with a light hand and then really intensify it. So this retails for $24. It's definitely nice. Um, the last thing I got in a BoxyCharm box for the month of August is this Clarins Velvet Lip Protector. Clarins Best Selling Natural Lip Pro Per oh, Perfector. I'm sorry, Clarence Velvet Lip Perfector. Clarence Best Selling Natural Lip Perfectors go gold with a new matte finish. A liquid lipstick with a weightless mousse texture that delivers a highly pigmented velvet, velvety finish with soft blur effect formulated with conditioning and nourishing shea butter, leaving lips feeling hydrated for hours. So I don't know why I'm gonna put this on because I'm gonna be wearing a mask in like five minutes. But let's just, for the sake of the video, just try it on. It comes like this little applicator and then I just squeeze it I guess yeah. oh I like this it gives you more control so you squeeze it as you're applying oh, I like this actually a lot I love this idea this retails for $26 I would definitely pay $26 for this one because my lips feel moisturized they don't feel dry they don't feel chapped um, the color doesn't feel like it's going anywhere. Like, it feels like it's dry and matted down. It's a beautiful shade, and the reds are hard to work with, and this applicator makes it so easy to control where the product goes, which I love. So all in all, guys, that is my review. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you all very soon when I do my September box of charm and some other videos. If you want to check out some of these products, they'll be linked below. As always, please make sure you hit the subscription button. I love you guys so much, and I will see you in my next video.